new fall cocktail to serve to your guests? Well, we've got you covered. I'm Gwen. I'm Jeff. And we are gonna make a pumpkin spice Russian today. Okay, Jeff, tell us how you first heard about this drink. Um, okay, so I was tending bar for a friend's girl's night and it was fall. They were looking for something new. Um, they'd been through a lot of the standard drinks. Um, so I, you know, pulled up the phone and did a Google search for fall cocktails and came across a pumpkin spice white Russian. Well, that uh, sounds perfect for a girl's night, right? Okay, well, let's get started, Jeff. Tell us what we need to do here. All right, so first we kind of, not necessary to rim the glass, but okay. uh, it can be kind of cool sometimes. So you would do three teaspoons of graham cracker crumbs, uh, one teaspoon each of pumpkin spice, and decorative sugar. So we have some pre-mixed Oh, there. voila, all mixed up. Okay, so we'll put that on a, on a plate, right? And then what do you, we have in here? Simple sugar? Uh, yeah, a little bit of simple syrup. Now, just water is generally um, one way you can try this, but sometimes it sticks a little better with a little bit of sugar. Okay, and then just kind of... Yeah, try and get on. some on there. Okay, and then kind of push it on the side, right? Yep, try and press it in. See, now I'm a person that doesn't want this stuff on the side of my cup because I feel like it's hard to drink. Oh, look, I missed that side. Okay, well, that looks I'm good. a novice, so, okay, so there's that. Okay, now yep. what? Do glass two, and we'll oh, okay. keep doing. Might All as well right. make two of these, right? So can you make these non-alcoholic, Jeff? Um, like if you, you had kids there and they wanted to, you know, because yes. kids always want, that's why we buy right. like the grape juice at the holidays, like for kids. Yeah, so it is possible. You could substitute um, for the vodka with apple cider, even oh. just a couple ounces of water. Um, substituting for the Kahlua is doable. There is, you know, there is kind of um, a virgin version of that out there. But honestly, I think that it probably make more sense to just look up pumpkin spice mocktails. Oh, and I you'd see. probably find something that is, you know, specifically designed. Um, Look at that, I'm a pro now. Yeah, nailed got it. it. Okay, so what all do we need here now? All right, so those are the beginning of the dry ingredients. What we do with this There's is, ice in there, right? There is ice in okay. here. Okay. So we begin with four ounces of vodka, um, three or four. We're gonna go four. We should go four. Because that's, that's how we roll around here. And we will have the recipe in the comments, so you don't have to worry about writing them down as we go. You can just watch Jeff work as magic. Yeah. Okay, so, so that's vodka. Yes, four ounces of that. Now, can you, I know they have like top shelf and low shelf vodka. Yes. Do you ha does it matter what kind for this? Does this? It doesn't really matter. I try to avoid, you know, your, your very bottom shelf for most, you know, good cocktails. If you're just, if you're just masking the alcohol for one of those drinks and it doesn't really matter. Okay. But, you know, something that, Something that smells and tastes pretty good to begin with. I see. So, All four right. ounces there. Then we're gonna go with, ah, we'll do the... So, uh, traditional white Russian is, you know, vodka, Kahlua, and then heavy cream or a creamer. Really, the only thing we're doing that different is we're doing three ounces of pumpkin spice creamer. And this is pumpkin spice season, in case you didn't know. How many ounces? Three. Okay, so four ounces of vodka, three ounces of pumpkin pie spice creamer. Yes. So okay. Very pumpkiny. Mmm. Reminds me of fall. Okay. Then what else? And then two ounces of Kahlua. Okay, so a, half Kahlua. Yes. Let which smell that. That's a rum and coffee liqueur. Mm. Yes. Um, so let's find two ounces there. So you could set up like a bar and just Google other fall drinks and just absolutely and ones that use the same ingredient, like some of the same ingredients. So you're not buying a ton, right? Yes. And a, a traditional as well, like a black Russian is just without this guy, right? So that and that. Oh, you don't put any creamer in. Right. Okay. Then, yeah. Okay. The, the creamer is what makes it, okay. it's what makes it the white Russian. 
So, I give this, I don't want to shake it too much, I want to blend it good. Let's get some ice for those glasses. How many cubes? Oh, those are kind of big. Only two or three in each, and let's see how that looks. My hands are clean. Okay. And I get to do the fun part at the end. <laughs> All right, so let's try get an even amount here. Oh, those look good. They look like the coffee my grandfather used to drink. He put a lot of milk in it. He might put vodka in it too. He probably did, and whiskey. I don't know. Who knows what? All. <laughs> it's all close right. enough. Close that can enough. be yours. You can have more. <laughs> oh, and then I'm not going to eat any of this because that's Kimberly's thing. All right. So this is right, right? Yeah, I'm going to put a little bit of a cream oh, on there. Oh, look at that. See, this all is the right. part I like decorating. <laughs> and then, yes, a little, just a pinch of that. The pumpkin Ooh, spice. Oh, it's getting happy. Yep. But guess what? This is the happiest part. <laughs> this is so fun. Okay, okay. If you don't have one of these, get one. It's smoking. I didn't do it enough, <laughs> did I? Oh, there. Oh. Oh, see the flame coming off there? Looks like a cigar. A nice cinnamon cigar. Yeah. Now, who would want to serve that to guests, right? Right. It looks great. That's fancy, and it was so simple. We <laughs> had three three um, ingredients there and just a couple other things you probably already have in your kitchen. Absolutely. Thanks so much, Jeff. Yep, absolutely. So, I hope you enjoy the fall. Um, a good, you know, warming fall drink. Get you through those evenings. Yep. And um, enjoy. Happy fall. <laughs>